mates, brothers, and all the ocean goers. Today, I'm taking a look at this save from actually 17 days ago. Yeah. It's quite a bit long ago. It's from an anonymous sender. But I think uh, they said something. They commented saying that they've already fixed it, so, but I'm welcome to take a look still. And take a look, I will, because... Oh, what's going on there? Getting a massage. <laughs> I see. Okay, okay. <laughs> all right, so this is the Amevian city. Let's just turn off all of this. And that is a very cool looking location, actually. What? Look at this. It's like a. Is this isn't. Is this a sea? Or like a lake or something? And then you got like. So. You have this inner lake. Let's take a look. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's straight up the ocean there. And the world map is kind of funky as well. Look at this. <laughs> that looks pretty cool. There's an army. No, you don't have an army. Okay. So what was the problem here? First campaign, and they didn't think they could salvage it. Managed to get to 900. Pure race build, and the idea was to build up an army to conquer southward and link up with a large lizard empire, maybe become their vassal. They won two wars against the neighboring dwarves, but have preferred to keep them as a buffer state until they can figure out how to beat beh what's behind them. The population collapsed to 800 shortly after they liberated 100 slaves to get to 900. They have the food, housing, and religion, and whatnot, so they're not sure what that went wrong. Okay. I want the population to get back up and for the army to get sorted out, okay. He's at war with us? No, okay. So these guys are probably the ones you were fighting against. And these guys were colleagues with... So which one's Ixbin? Ixbin is the northern one. And our brother here wants to go south. And they want the population sorted. Honestly, this doesn't look that bad. You're in a decent spot. Like, you got 100% law. You got probably enough food. Hold on. Ah, oh, okay. You don't actually have enough food. <laughs> Let's see what that's like. No, it's not the food rations. No, you straight up just don't have enough food. And then what else? One of the army sorted. Okay, so to get the population sorted, obviously, we would need to feed everyone better. But we have a worker deficit right now. And that's because they freed a bunch of slaves, and then I'm assuming those slaves just rebelled or something. That's typical slave behavior. Let's just go through your industries and then see where we can what we can turn off and then fix the food production. I think this is probably going to be a quick one. Well, I don't, I don't even need to send this back to the guy because he's already finished this campaign apparently. He had like 5,000 pops and everything. <laughs> but it's still a learning experience for everybody. Oh, you got a temple. That's crazy. Temple of Crater. I don't think I've even made one yet. So let's follow. It ki yeah, it kind of seems like you don't really need my help here. Alrighty guys, I figured out what's wrong. The bloody fisheries are bugged. So these are making like nothing. Like it says deep sea 20%, right? I'm just going to rebuild it like that. I didn't even rebuild it. I just literally just click that button. There we go. And that should unbug it. We should turn off these still. Turn those off, both of those. Alrighty. Yeah, and look at it, now look at the food production. Good lord, what the hell, man. Oh, you wanna link up with these people here, I see. 
One, two, three. Yeah. Alrighty. Well, honestly, you're popping off, my guy. And what else? You were just... Yeah, you are just hampered by the... Whatchamacallit? <laughs> the bugged fishing. The bugged fisheries. Well, I don't know if that affected you or it was just me. That's fixed now. And these scaffolds. This guard post. And scaffold, uh, whatchamacallit? Combination. Should deal with this pretty well. Uh, like the law. You have plenty of fish now. You can't even store it. <laughs> we need to upgrade your storage. Alright, there we go. We reached the 900 population. That's the population you wanted. You just need to look at this. Keep your production rate up. But honestly, just keep fishing the ocean here. Keep upgrading the research. And then you'll be all good. As for everything else, as for the weaponry and stuff, we're going to need 800. 800 swords. How much is that? It's going to be very expensive, isn't it? 800. 1000. Okay, for this price, you may as well just hire a mercenary and just take these guys out. Yeah, like, that was a million. Wait, how much are these guys? Oh, okay. <laughs> what? What are these mercenaries? The Dorian Archers. Yikes. Oh god, they're both Dorian Archers? That's terrible. What the hell? That's actually disgusting. Alright, so you want three depots? Giving you your basic materials, and then two, getting you the weapons, right? Alright, we're gonna have them fetch from this warehouse. Everything. Some of the soldiers are not fully trained to specification yet, and will continue to train before they join an army. Let's turn that on, and then send those two to the world map. And your population drop because, yeah, there's people just left. And we let in a bunch of people again. There we go. Now you have this army of 100 people. And they don't have any weapons. Perfect. <laughs> Maybe we, instead of these... Yeah, and then we sell... The tools. 400. Buy 400 of. Th oh, okay. 200? Wow. This guy's scamming you? Oh my. They are. You guys are terrible. Alrighty, guys. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sell all of this. And like 2,000 fish or something. Yeah, just sell a bunch of crap. Only four, two, and then there you go. There's not enough money to hire the other people, but yeah, okay. We should actually play it safe. Forty, two hundred, and thirteen. We go. Clear war. Now, for some reason, it says we're gonna lose. Hope we don't lose. So that would suck. These Dendorian arches are gonna be the death of me for real. The 
defense. We literally just need these guys defending. And we need these guys to flank. So let's go ahead and start. There we go. And we'll get behind them. What are our archers doing? There we go. <laughs> Bloody hell. Actually, we don't even have an admin building, so this is probably a terrible idea. Release. We don't even have any prisoners. Let's kill them. Kill the lack of prisoners. And then get rid of these expensive dudes. Give the other guys to just help us, just in case. Mercy. I mean, we need someone to... X. What's the chivalry stuff? I don't even know what this does. Just occupy it. Wait, do you not need admin? Anymore. What do you need admin for? Alright, get rid of this. Oh my... Good thing I didn't make a building guide. You have six workforce, apparently. <sighs> what is all this, my guy? What do we even do here? Get wood? Actually, who hates us? Turnians hate us. Dorians don't care. Our theme is like us. Humans like us. Okay, so we just literally just kill Cretonians. That's the only ones we don't care about. We've taken your first region. Yeah, you don't even need... The hell? You don't even need admin anymore. It's plenty of health. Quarantine... Wait, so you can actually just rush your... Oh, wow. Okay. You can just rush your neighboring regions now. Well, that would have been nice to know sooner. 161. Yeah, you just keep your army here. For now. Actually, we should probably send these guys home. Pull the troops out to see how it goes, how it looks. Yeah, the loyalty is kind of terrible, so yeah, it kind of looks like you need to keep someone there. At least until the... The support increases, yeah. May as well put it at your border. The inner border. Yeah, there you go. We have plenty of... Actually, we just... You don't have enough rations. Because we're not importing it. Oof. That could have been terrible. And clothing. We should probably import clothing. You train up your soldiers at home, and then... Yeah. There you go. That's pretty much it. I don't know how long that took. It was probably an hour. 72 minutes, apparently. So I hope that helps, and thank you for sending in your save. Even though... Yeah, you pretty much... Had it sorted. Like... I don't know if this is the problem you ran into, but... Yeah, just refurnished your fisheries and restarted them. Got the food production going. And then... Turn these ones off, because these ones don't produce as much fish. Sorted out a bit of your production. I'm pretty sure you can figure out, yeah, all that stuff. Main things you were missing were 
a fight pit, which is just free. It's just free um, happiness there. And in the toilet, you didn't have enough, and they weren't upgraded. As for your other services, they're probably not upgraded either. But yeah, you know, you're pretty sure you already know <laughs> all of this now. And so it took so long to make this, but for other people watching this video, I hope that you learned something this yeah this time around. Yeah, this save will be publicly uploaded for educational purposes. So yeah. It's in version 66. May as well download. Yeah, give it a try. Have a download. It's a pretty cool city made by Anonymous here. And that's it for me. Authorized by Ocean Man of Oceania.